Terrytown Travel Center, the RV Superstore. This is John from Terrytown RV in Grand Rapids, Michigan. And today I want to show you this brand new 2017 Bighorn. It is a 3875FB. It sleeps four, has three slides, and is 41 feet, nine inches long. This big horn has tight turn technology, a six point automatic leveling system. Uh, it has a bunch of really big storage compartments that I'll show you right now. It has a ripper pin box and a large power awning with LED light and a couple exterior speakers. All right, here's one of those big storage areas right in the front. Nice and clean, some generator stuff, some hydraulic fluid. All right, this is where you put your propane tanks. This is one of your levelers right there in the front. Here's one of your marine grade exterior speakers. This is the big, massive pass-through storage area. Uh, it's really large. It looks like the guys here are doing some work on this right now, so rest assured it will be in tip-top condition before it goes out to anybody. But there's an LED light in here. And I believe the people from Heartland like to call this the Big Texas storage area or something like that. But they're essentially just trying to say this has the maximum amount of storage possible. They really tried to maximize the storage. All right, it does have a bunch of these UV frameless windows. A very attractive graphics package. It has four large entrance steps. It comes with these aluminum wheels. And this does have the Yeti package, which is basically the cold weather package. So it has weather guard and it's made for seasonal RVing. There's the name, 3875FB. There's a big grab handle here. I'll give you a better look at this awning. All right, let's look at the rear profile. You can see it comes with the ladder. There's a really large UV protected window in the back. Pretty nice looking back profile. Very sleek. There's another storage compartment. This is the other side of your pass through storage. And this is the utility center. As you can see, they even incorporated some stuff so you can tie down anything you want to in this large storage area. All right, let's go on and step inside. All right, as we enter this Bighorn Montana 3875 FB, you can see the dining area, the living area in the rear, entertainment center, kitchen, lots of pantry space here. There's actually an extra room right there. I'll show you in a minute. I'm back to the bedroom full bathroom in the rear, and a walk-in closet. As we walk into this big horn, we'll look to the right, you see the control panel, and this will help you control your lights, your water, your slides. It's accessible as soon as you walk in. Look ahead a little bit more. This is where your thermostat is, and your fantastic vent fan, and your fantastic vent fan controls. And your fantastic vent fan is basically like, like a small attic fan. It just works really well to pull out a lot of air to really get the air circulating. While we're up here, we might as well check out these fixtures. These are the kitchen fixtures. There's a fan in the living room area as well. Notice all the woodwork on these slide-out fascias. Okay, let's get a look at this dining table. This is called buckskin decor, and I believe this pattern is part of that decor. Um, all of these large windows are going to come with blackout shades and day shades. This is the buckskin. I'll give you a little bit closer look. Okay, these twin recliners are really great. Uh, they actually allow you to apply heat, have uh, massage operations, they have a built-in light. So they're very deluxe and they're really comfortable and they will massage you. And then this couch is a tri-fold bed. Come with these decorative pillows as well. And you have a really large back window in the back here some overhead storage with the decorative glass. We'll come over to our entertainment center. We have a big screen HD TV, lots of storage here, lots of wood all over this slide out. It gives it a classy feel with all the wood and also, and also, all, and also this big slide out just really opens up this trailer and makes it feel very roomy. Okay, here's your multimedia player. And this multimedia player has Bluetooth, MP3 capabilities, you can hook up USB, auxiliary, you can play your DVDs in it, and you can also download an app for your phone so you can just pull up your app and then control this. It also will control the speakers outside, the speakers in here, and the speakers in the back bedroom separately. Pretty decent sized storage space. 
and storage space underneath as well. All right, we've got a really large island kitchen with a bunch of storage space underneath. Okay, we've got pull-out drawers. Looks like, okay, we've got real drawers with real screws. Big drawer on the bottom so you can actually put your pot and pans in it. Sometimes you just get these little tiny ones and you're like, oh, thanks for my non-functional trailer. All right, lots of storage space underneath the sink too. And the solid surface countertops in here are Hi-Max by LG. A little bit closer so you can see the texture. Yeah, they're very rich looking. All right, let's check out this sink. All right, looks like stainless steel, stainless steel dual bowl. We've got a really big bowl on the left, high profile pull out spare sink. Pull it out. Okay. We've got a bunch more countertop space over the oven. Right there, and the oven is stainless steel. Let's pull this up. Okay, these are covers over a three burner range top. Solid surface covers. We've got a large stainless steel microwave. Looks like a wine rack above the microwave. Some drawers to the left of the oven. Another space to the right of the oven. Over here we've got a whole bunch of pantry space. Yeah, look how big that storage space is. And then you've got a really large refrigerator. I think I looked and it was a 22.6 cubic refrigerator. That's really large. Oops, the door's closing on me. You can see how that's a really good size. All right, one thing I didn't talk about yet is the floor. Um, and this will come with a Dyson vacuum, which is why I think there's a Dyson sticker on the floor. There is a vinyl stone look floor. It's pretty textured and pretty 3D looking and not a uh, not cheap looking and flat like some of them you see. I also really like the texture of the carpet in here. Go a little bit closer look on that. Okay, again, just notice how big this island actually is. And I like the contrasting darker panels on the lighter wood too. All right, I'm gonna zoom out real quick so you can just get a view of the whole kitchen. All right, now let's check out this little office space. Uh, you have an option to make this space either a half bath or a little office. I think they call it an office, but they kind of also imply that you can use all this storage for extra pantry space. As you can see, there are two doors on the left, two doors on the right that I opened up, and you can see that there's actually a lot of storage space there. There's a power fan on the ceiling in here still, even though it's not a bathroom anymore, which is nice to get some airflow going through here. But there's a big workspace here where you could put your computer, um, or whatever else you'd want to do if you needed to get away from it and do something serious, you can definitely do that. And there's some more drawers and storage space in the bottom as well. Okay, there's even more pantry space right here next to the steps. And there are the steps and they're covered by that carpet. And there's even a drawer in the middle. Cool little storage space drawer. Let's open up this, check it out. Oh, okay, this is more like a little coat rack area. So they got the two hooks. A uh, spot on the bottom where you can presumably put your shoes or something. Close that, have some more space on top here. Okay, and then we'll step up the stairs, back into the bedroom. Some large windows you can use for a fire escape, uh, a built-in dresser, a bunch of big drawers there. I'll pull them out. You can feel that these drawers are nice too and well-made. So you don't have to worry about quality being a factor there. Let's open this up too for some more storage space. Another cupboard door, and this is a spot where you'd put your TV. There's a cable and a power plug in above it. We're to the bed, and this looks like a king bed to me. I'm not sure exactly what kind of bed this is. Uh, it says I relax sleep systems, but it feels insanely comfortable. It feels like it's memory foam. I like the textured headboard, um, and even the walls in here are textured, and they have a really cool panel door. I like it when I see panel doors in these. It just kind of gives it a, a modern edge and look and doesn't waste so much space. Okay, let's walk on into the back bedroom. Same vinyl flooring in here. Porcelain foot flush toilet. A large medicine cabinet that has the exact same solid surface. A whole bunch of drawers. Cabinet. Another cabinet door. Let's see this. Ah, and it's American stone cast sink. Or so that it will withstand temperatures up to 500 degrees, which is great. We've got more storage up above and a mirror. The 
open this up, put one in your room, and then three vanity lights above the mirror. Okay, let's look over to the left. This is actually a very large closet door. Open this up. This is where your washer and dryer prep would be if you want to put one of those in, but otherwise it's just a really great storage area. There are shelves in there that you can move up and down. All right, there's a power fan in this bathroom. Looks like a large one-piece shower with a seat. Pretty nice sprayer. Decorative glass shower door. And in the back, we have a walk-in closet with mirror doors, sliding mirror doors, uh, the same carpet that's in the other room, more dresser space, uh, another cupboard there, and a few more shelves back here, and there's your Dyson vacuum. I'm sorry it's a little bit dark in here. I did not haul out a battery to this spot today like I normally do. Uh, it's a pretty sunny day, so I just left the windows open. But So sorry, you can't see the closet that well. Okay, so that's been the 2017 Bighorn fifth wheel, uh, the 3875FB. I'm John from Terrytown RV. Okay, recapping this unit, uh, the things I like about it, I like the big storage, I like the big floor plan, I like the solid surface countertops, they're great looking. Uh, I really like the texture of the carpet and the massage power chairs with heat are pretty great and I also like the little half office in place of the half bathroom. So yeah, that's that's been the Bighorn. I'm John. Feel free to come down to Terrytown RV. Our motorhomes to go is right next door to call, email. We'll, we'd be happy to show you around big units like this or small units or motorhomes or whatever you want to see. And we'd be happy to answer all of your questions. So yeah, thanks for taking this tour with me and have a great day. Give Terrytown RV a call today so we can put our buying power and experienced service to work for you. We look forward to earning your business. Terrytown RV. Don't forget to like comment, and subscribe to our YouTube page to stay updated on new content. Our Facebook link and websites are located in the descriptions below. Terrytown RV.